Welcome to DIY Solar Homestead. So, I'm getting ready for the Grand Solar Minimum. It's taking a little bit. The storm's going to hit Michigan pretty hard. And uh, I've been watching Oppenheimer, Ranch Project, and a whole bunch of others. This one is ADAPT 2030. That's all of Europe. It's going to wipe them out. So we're not the only ones. I taped up three windows in there. I taped up a window in here. These three behind me might get taped up in plastic tonight. So the garden room upstairs needs to be taped in, in plastic. Whew. I got a shovel. I got to clean off the solar panels. I don't have the solar batteries hooked up. So, I'm not 100% fully equipped yet. So, I might go connect some batteries up right now. I'm not going to get a full charge, but every little bit's going to help. And if the grid goes down for three days, our grid is not prepared for this kind of cold. We've never seen this cold, and we've never had to prepare for it. And the, the media is still preaching global warming, which ended in 2008. So, I found out several years later, uh, uh, it was uh, 2011 and 12, I was working on a solar pool heater because I was getting sick and tired not being able to get in the swimming pool. <laughs> so that's, and then I got into studying the climate change and all that. So, if you want to really know the, the, the news, What's really going on, ADAPT 2030, this lady's blaming me, I almost didn't read that. You got David Schlothauer is the best meteorologist in the world, and you got Diamond from Oppenheimer Ranch Project, there's a whole bunch of others out there. There's Climate Guy and a few others, but um, you gotta, gotta get prepared. I want you all to get do what you can for today if you're in the middle of the storm or you're gonna get the storm. So all of you on the, uh, the trail in this, it's going to hit me tonight, I guess, or tomorrow. And uh, those of you in New York, buckle down. Start preparing. Get your water. Get your food in the basement. Do everything you got to do. I think the grid's going to go down in a lot of places. All right. So be prepared, not scared. Get your stuff around. I gotta, I gotta get things around for the basement myself. It's the basement's always cold. I got a little bit of a wood heater down there. It's for, it's for camping. It's for a tent. But it is a wood stove, and I got plenty of wood in the garage. I think. So hopefully the the pipes won't freeze. Everybody out there, be safe and get yourself prepared. All right, and uh, take care. Have a have a good night.